the exploding buses, the suicide bombers, I don't underestimate this. But finally, by the end of the day, they could have done much worse to Israel. Because what Israel is doing to them now for 100 years, if you want, you shouldn't maybe start in 67, but in 48, and maybe with the uprising of, of Zionism. You, you wonder how tolerant they are, because still I believe that the majority of the Palestinians, at least this is my impression from the grassroots, I don't mean to it's really the grassroots, they want to live side by side together, but in dignity and equality. But they want to live side by side, while the Israeli sentiment is separation, not living together. That's a big difference. I, I saw an interesting segment on Israeli television in which it was quite a rare, I thought, expression of dissent by journalists who complained that the real horrors of what are happening in Gaza aren't being seen by the Israeli public. And I was just wondering, do you think that's true? Do you think actually much of the Israeli public isn't actually aware 